If we could get a many to many front 180, that would be sick. Yeah, but that's what I was fearing. <laughs> What is up guys, welcome back to the channel, to another session video, and to a floaty hard flip. Today we're skating the Paris DLC map once again. I really wanted to skate some of the more obscure spots today, like this one, like gapping over the fence to this barrier. And we'll just be going around the map, seeing what we can find, and hopefully having a good session. Let's get into it. I have to be honest, I am on my unrealistic settings right now, so it means that the game is a bit more floaty, we can pop a bit higher, but I need that right now to get over the fence, even though sometimes it doesn't work. Also, I just changed the sun angle so that we can see the spot a bit better, but hey, we got a nose grind. Little front blunt, a bit sketchy on the way out, let's add something to the exit. Oh. Wow, okay, we definitely got to do something like that. Gapping from one barrier to the other. But I just wanted to get a pig spin out first, and we technically got it. There we go with the backside flip out too. Okay, let's see if we can get into that. So I will just try to like use the standard side popping. So if we get into the trick at the right angle, we should be able to just naturally pop over there. Maybe I should ditch the flip. There we go. That actually took a while just to get something on both barriers, but we'll keep it going. We'll see what else we get into. Maybe something like that. That was so dumb. Finally, but that crook was so badly pinched, but whenever I get into a good pinch, I can't get out of it. Ah, oh, man, I hate this spot. Awesome. Ah, oh, that is so bad, but hey, we are moving on, and I'm also getting back to my normal settings. Oh, I don't like that spot. I know this way we have those weird, like, bar spots. You know what? I actually haven't skated this one. I guess you could gap up to that from the ledge. That one is hard to skate. You know what? We're just moving on. We're gonna find something else. Even though this way is actually kind of cool. You can gap from rail to rail, but it's not really the hidden, obscure spots that I'm looking for. I gotta be something like maybe a little out in the open that I just haven't really thought about. And I think we're on to something here. A great start. That is a pretty fun spot. I didn't mean to do that, but it was actually kind of cool. Ooh. <laughs> I was actually trying back nose blunt. We'll uh, redo that with something else in, I think. Maybe something like... Oh, okay. I keep getting into the nose slide, but... I mean, we're getting some cool tricks here. Not really on purpose, though. There we go, nice. Nolly barrel for the nose man, it's back nose blunt. A straight blunt? I don't know. Can we go the other way? I actually really like this little spot. But if we just like low pop into it. Uh, I think I tapped somewhere along there. No, I don't think that's happening. But that's a fun little spot going from the mani into the grind. Oh, would you look at that? And I actually already skated it, so we do have a piece of plywood up there. So, I don't know, should we start on our board or just like this? Maybe just like this. Let's see if we can throw down up here. 
Okay, we actually got something first try, but I did not expect to kick the front nose on that part. Maybe it is just easier starting on our board. Oh, okay. See, this is a fun spot too. Oh, we got to do some combo stuff after I get the kick the nose many. But it's just really hard to turn out of it. And not hit the other box. Okay, it was super bad, but that is just the one we'll have to take. Yeah, okay, quick feed and stuff is uh, not my favorite thing to do in session. Just because it feels like there is, you know, somewhat of a delay from your input to the time your skater actually does it. But that would be fun to do something like that. You know what? I don't think I'll be doing that, but since we are up here, let's just uh, try something. That's kind of cool. I like that. Like stupid gnar. So what hard flip do you guys prefer? This one or the one we did in the intro? Ah, oh, man, I need to get a good one. Like that? <laughs> Could actually land in a grind on that. <laughs> okay, where did we come from? We came from our original, like, combo thing I wanted to do. Oh, you can't tic tac your way forward in this game? Okay, I'm afraid that third one is gonna be a little too close for us to actually do this. So maybe I should just, like, do a Manny to Manny, but try to really rotate on the other one. I mean, we got it. We got it. We got something. Okay, that was a nice many front 180. If we could get a many to many front 180, that would be sick. Yeah, but that's what I was fearing. <laughs> ah, damn it. I figured out if I don't pop out of the second one, we might actually be able to get it. But damn, this is a hard spot to skate session. And I keep hitting that, but hey, I love the challenge here. We really got to thread the needle on the landing. Damn it! Yeah, that was just stupid. There we go! Oh! <laughs> I really wanted a super cool line, but hey, that's fair. Can't really have it all. But man, I really like this spot. This is super fun to skate super weird but we just narrowly avoided hitting like our head and our arm on the uh what is it a book stand or something i don't know and then of course not landing into the lamppost this time then i missed the switch flip front crook well i think that was it for today's session let me know if you have skated these spots and if you enjoyed them and then i'll just be seeing you in the very next video so until then have it good and peace out